Last night, I stumbled across a website that claims that it creates AI-generated blog posts that are SEO-optimized that can be imported right into your WordPress website and is undetectable by Google Bot. So what we're going to do in this video is I'm going to preview this website. I'm going to reveal my step-by-step -step plan on using this website to create a brand new blog and see how much money we can make. So make sure you watch this entire video to learn about the website, how to start a blog, and if you should give this a try. Hi, my name is Alston Godbolt with AustinGodbolt.com. I create content to actually help you make money online and not just to put money into my own pockets. And if you want to be added to this globe, simply reply or comment down below with your city, state, province, country, and I'll get you pinned. So as you know, one of the best ways to start affiliate marketing is with a blog. However, we know that writing blogs takes a long time. It can be challenging, and this website actually claims to take care of everything for us. So what we're gonna do is I'm going to talk about my plan on starting a brand new blog. I'm gonna tell you about the niche. I'm gonna tell you about how you can find keywords. And of course, I'm gonna tell you about this website so that you can be a part of it. So the first thing that we wanna do is we want to talk about finding a niche. Everybody says that, every niche is saturated, but I'm here to tell you that that's not actually the case. And what we're gonna do, if we just take a look at my screen here, I'm on amazon.com, the website that everybody goes to. And I'm just gonna find a niche by clicking on all, gonna come down here to shop by department, and I'm going to click on home and garden. Now, I'm going to take a look, and I'm just gonna pick appliances. Now, I already have a blog that is in some all appliances, so we're not gonna focus on that. What we are gonna focus on is we're gonna focus on things like ice makers, beverage centers, wine cellars, dishwasher, uh, freezers, and so on. So we're gonna create content in this space. That is going to be the first step, identifying a niche. The second step is coming up with a domain name and web hosting. Now, if you click the first link in the description, it'll take you to the best web hosting provider for beginners. But what I like to do is I like to come over here and type in just different keywords to get ideas of domain. So we could type in something like, uh, we could type in something like home appliances. So as you can see here, we'll type in home appliances and that one's actually taken. So we could change this to maybe best or try and find different variations of home appliance. We could say something like home appliance plan it like this and to see if that's already taken. But again, what you're going to do is you're just going to type in different keywords that are relevant to your, your niche. Now, this isn't absolutely necessary for SEO. Uh, that was something that was important maybe five to 10 years ago, but Google and the other uh, search engines are smart enough to know what your content's about, but it's just nice to have something that is related. Step two is going to be getting your domain name and web hosting. Again, if you wanna go on this adventure, this journey with me, you are going to need web hosting to get up and running. The first link in the description will take you to the best web hosting provider for beginners. Now that we have our domain name and our web hosting set up, the next step is we wanna go out and find keywords. Now what we're going to do is we are going to go over to Keywords Explorer. Now this is a paid keyword research tool, yes. Ahrefs is a paid keyword research tool. There are other options out there that are free and maybe lower cost, but Ahrefs is what I use, so that's what I'm going to talk about. Now, if we come back over here, what we can do is we can just click on freezers, for example, and what we're going to do is we are going to type in best freezers. Hit enter. And then we are going to go over to matching terms. And this is how we're going to find our keywords. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to include one more word. We're going to include the word for, click apply, and then click show results. Now, what we're looking for is we're looking for best deep freezers for garage, best freezers for garage, and so on. So I'm just going to open up this one like this. And I am looking for a few different things and I'll explain to you exactly what I'm looking for once we get there. So what I'm looking for is I'm looking at the domain ranking and I'm looking at um, this number. I want this number to be 40 or less. So as you can see here, um, this website is a small website. This website here, uh, the domain ranking is 36. So that's a small website. The closer to 100, the larger the website, so Best Buy, example, for example, is 89. Um, the Spruce is 90. So what I'm looking for is at least two websites that have a domain ranking of 40 
or less, so zero to 40. So I could potentially write on this, best deep freezers for garage. I'm gonna come back over here and maybe open up this one, this one, and maybe best freezers for breast milk and for meat. So if we look at this, once again, we're gonna scroll down and we're gonna take a look. I think we already looked at this one, but you can see 36 and 39. If we look at this one, we scroll down again, um, this one, 36, 35, 39. So this could actually be a good keyword to target because we want to give ourselves the best chance to rank. If we look at this one, once again, we're gonna scroll down again. And this one looks like it's too competitive. So we're actually going to close that. But what we're gonna do is we're going to get a list of about 20 different keywords that we wanna write on. Look at this one. We scroll up, best, best freezers for breast milk. This number one spot here, has a domain ranking of four. This is a teeny tiny micro website, but if we look, there's at least three or four that have a domain ranking of 40 or less. This could potentially be something that we rank on. Now, if we look at this one, again, you can see the domain ranks aren't too bad. We could potentially rank for this. And so what we wanna do is collect all of our keywords. So we've got five or six of them. Again, you wanna get 20. Here's a quick note on using Ahrefs. Yes, I understand it's expensive. It's an investment into your business. What you can do is you can get it for one month, do all of the research that you need, and then cancel the subscription. There's also gigs over on Fiverr where people will actually do the keyword research for you. Make sure that you give them the parameters of what you're looking for, and they should turn or return something that is decent. There are other platforms out there that might be cheaper, but I use Ahrefs because I trust the numbers that it returns. What you'd want to do if we go back over to Amazon is we could find a total of 20 for this niche. Okay. So we want to find 20 total for ice makers, beverage centers, wine coolers, dishwasher, freezers, and so on. Now that we have that, we are going to take it to this AI writing software and it's going to do all of the heavy lifting for us. And this AI writing software is called content at scale.ai. And as you can see here, they will upload 2,600 word plus word blog posts and it will bypass AI content detection, all with no human intervention. And the way that this works, and I'll put a link down in the description to take you right to this, and the way that it works is you basically will put in your keywords, that's why we found our keywords, and you give it a little bit of information and it's gonna actually do all the work for us. Now in the past, I've talked about using stuff like jasper.ai, but the problem with Jasper is that you still have to massage the content. You have to be present for the content to, to continue putting out um, output. But with this software, it claims to do everything for you in just a few clicks. That's why we're going to test it out. And this will also be a good test as to how competent AI writing is in 2023 and if you should rely on it for all of your content. So this is going to be a great test for a few reasons. We'll be able to see if this gets traffic and if blogging is still worth it in 2023. Now, in future videos, because this will be a series, future videos, I will show you exactly step-by-step step how to create those 20 blog posts, but what you'll need to do, and of course, this is a paid tool. What you'll need to do, obviously, is sign up. I'll put a link in the description for you to sign up and you will basically give it minimal information and it will come up with 2,600 word blog posts that will help you rank. And basically what you wanna do is you'll want to rank, you'll build some domain authority on these different uh, questions, and then we can actually make some money with affiliate programs. Now what we'll do, and this is going to be a future us project, is we're already an affiliate for Amazon. We could go out and find different affiliate programs for these other products. For example, if we look at deep freezers once again, let's say uh, Frigidaire, we can come up here and we can type in something like, let's do LG, LG affiliate program. And we can see if LG has a standalone affiliate program. We can also see if other companies pay out better. For example, we could take a look and see what Best Buy, Best Buy affiliate program is and how much they pin, plan to pay. And if they pay better, then Amazon, we can simply just apply. We could also take a look at different affiliate networks to see if they offer affiliate programs that pay out a little bit better. And what we'll do is we'll write 20 blog posts every single month using content at scale to help us 
make money online and we'll document the results. We'll document how much traffic we're getting. We're doc we'll document different clicks. And if we actually make money with this process, make sure that you click the follow button so that you are notified when I upload a brand new video about this new AI writing software. Now that you know how I plan on writing blog posts with out actually writing blog posts, click the second link in the description for your free affiliate marketing planners. Those planners will help you plan and organize your affiliate marketing business so that you can make more money online. Click the first link in the description or go to alstongodbold.com forward slash start to learn more. Watch this video next because YouTube says it will help you grow your online business.